What's happening guys? Welcome back to the channel. Welcome back to another video with your boy Thick Whips. Today we are going to be working on the brakes, ceramic coating the wheels, cleaning up that whole area. Grab yourself a coffee, sit back, relax, and enjoy the video. So the BMW Supra has not been ceramic coated, paint corrected, anything like that. We are gonna do a whole series on that. We're actually gonna be using graphene by Ethos Car Care. It's gonna be a really, really interesting video or series, I should say. But today we are gonna be addressing the wheels and the brakes on the Supra. So all of the wheels that I had for the M2 were ceramic coated as well as the M3 and the F30 and it made just living and cleaning the car and keeping it clean so much easier. So we're gonna go ahead and attack these wheels today. We're gonna to ceramic coat them. I'm just gonna do one coating because I do have another set of wheels coming for this car that I'm mainly going to be using. These are just my stock wheels that I will be using in the off months or the off times that I don't have the aftermarket wheels on. So I partnered up with Golden Wrench, you guys. Golden Wrench is a company that has a bunch of different products for our cars. They make these cool little decals, the super decals that go on the brakes. They also have billet oil cabs, paddle shifters, a bunch of cool stuff for the Supras and other BMWs as well. If you guys wanna go ahead and check out their website, I'll leave a link down in the description. Also, I have a discount code with them, Thick Whip, that is gonna get you, I believe it's 10% off of anything that you buy in their store. Golden Wrench, thank you for sending out the super decals. I got a couple more things coming from them that I'm gonna be installing on the channel, but today we are addressing the wheels and brakes. So this is mostly the stuff that we're gonna be using today. Um, I got some of my tools that I'll need, and then of course, these are the little decals, little card from Golden Wrench, as well as the ceramic coating that I'm gonna be using. I'll have all this stuff linked down below for you guys, and then some of the cleaning stuff. If I had some Simple Green, I literally just ran out. Simple Green would be perfect for cleaning off the wheels. I have this little guy over here that we're gonna be using to take the wheels outside and just wash them down. But as you guys can see, the brakes on here are just very, very basic. The decal will go right there on the caliper. I think it's gonna look nice. You can get a white one. I ended up going with black. So first we're gonna go ahead and take off the wheels and one by one clean them as thorough as possible. Then we will go ahead and put on our new decal and then I will go ahead and ceramic coat the calipers. We're just gonna do one layer of ceramic coating. That should be plenty. After I ceramic coat the calipers, I'll also go ahead and ceramic coat the wheels and one coat should be plenty. I don't see really any reason to do more than that. This is like the only dry day that we'll have this week. So it's wise to go ahead and just knock it out today before we get any rain. Stuff takes about 24 hours to cure. Just don't wanna get it wet after you coat it. But all in all, you guys, this process is relatively easy. It shouldn't take me more than like an hour to do all four wheels and all four brakes. Let's go ahead and get into it. These were already extremely clean, but just a little bit of isopropyl, a rag, got them looking nice. This little guy, basically, just gonna go like that. It's gonna look good. I really like the black. The big break kit that I'm looking at doing is not red. Uh, I'm not like the biggest fan of red calipers, to be entirely honest, but this is just what the car comes with, so we ride with it until we do a upgraded brake kit. I don't hate it, I just don't love it. <laughs> the back ones, are just kind of an embarrassment. <laughs> They're just uh, pretty puny. So for the back, we won't even touch them. We'll just go ahead and ceramic coat the wheels, clean them up. Um, I cleaned off this wheel pretty good, just letting it dry. I'll take another rag and go over it, but I just used some simple degreaser. You could use like simple green, that'll work too. And then a little bit of isopropyl, to finish it off. But yeah, everything looks good, man. I mean, this is not, this is gonna be very, very easy. Car's so new that it's, I love having a new car because it's so easy to work on. Everything just comes right off. All right, so I'm gonna go ahead and throw on this decal. Pretty dope. I dig it. Now, I'm gonna take a little bit of this, one of these guys. We're gonna get to coating. Thank you. 
this is uh, kind of like a textured surface to it. So I'm not even gonna level it out. I'm just gonna leave it. I'm just gonna put on one coat and send it. If these were like my new calipers, like when I did my white ones on my M2, I put two layers on and I let them cure like an hour in between putting each layer on. So I did those really, really well. And just cause they're white, they're kind of harder to keep clean. But after I ceramic coated them, they stayed clean. They were so easy to keep clean. I do notice that these actually don't, these brakes really don't produce that much brake dust. I mean, in comparison to the M2, the M2 was really bad with brake dust. This car doesn't really produce that much brake dust. So I'm not worried about keeping these clean. Um, I think this is just gonna be fine. But you could tell almost immediately when I put on the ceramic coating, it had a much deeper red like look to it. Looks really good. All right, I'm gonna bring the first wheel in and ceramic coat it. All right, this thing is super clean right now. These are satin black. The stock super wheels are satin black. So this will shine them up a little bit, but we're not going crazy. I'm just doing one very basic coat on it. And this is high temp ceramic. So you can use this stuff on like brakes, you know, wheels, things that tend to get a little bit hotter and it should hold up just fine. Oh yeah, you can definitely tell on camera. <laughs> it's got a lot more of a, uh, like a gloss finish to it now. So it was crystallizing pretty quick as I was putting it on. Typically you would want to level it out after you put it on, but honestly, I'm not even gonna touch it. I'm just gonna let it do its thing and cure just because I don't really see any like swirl marks or high points on it. And for these just being stock used wheels, uh, we're just gonna send it with one coat as is. If you guys are buying a new set of wheels, you should always ceramic coat them when they're brand new. Super easy, the best time to do it, and it just keeps them clean. The cleaner the wheel is, the better that the ceramic is going to adhere to the wheel. You're just gonna have a much better result with the ceramic coating when the wheel is brand new. So while this one is curing, I'm gonna go ahead and pull off the back wheel, start cleaning that. And really, you guys, it's the same process for the back, no different. I'm gonna go ahead and do that one. And then we'll jack up the car and I will do the brake side over here and we'll work on these two as well. Fire, dude. Wheels look really good. Stuff cured nice. Damn, that is a fire setup though. Not gonna lie, that looks pretty good. That looks pretty good, really happy with it. All right, I will say, this turned out really good. Dude, super happy with that decal on the front. What a difference that made, wow. All right, so I'm gonna go ahead and tackle the other side of the car and then we'll go ahead and pull the car out.
I'd say we did a fine job, gentlemen. Looks pretty good to me. The wheels do look a lot more on the glossy side. It's got like a bit more depth to them now. Looks really good. It's gonna be 10 times easier to keep these clean, that's for sure. There you guys have it. Love this car, man. It's so much fun to work on. I'm having a blast with this car. We haven't even gotten into like the real stuff. We're just doing like the easy stuff. Anyways guys, thank you so much for watching the video. I'm gonna have links to everything you saw in the video down below, but um, we're gonna go ahead and wrap this one up. Thank you guys for watching. Please do subscribe, comment down below, like this video, hit that bell notification. Just like that, this video is over and we're out.